What is up everyone, my name is Chrono, and welcome back to some more Take One Plays Xenoblade Chronicles. So, I've been doing some thinking, and originally, I was actually going to just go on with the story, because I thought, why not? It makes the most sense. Because I started looking at what is in the game and after game, and like, what we can do, and after looking at it, it makes sense to just do a lot of the stuff later, because with New Game Plus, I didn't know what actually changed over. Uh, all the quests would be deleted, meaning I would have to go through the whole game again, getting every single quest again, and doing everything 100% again, and I really don't want to like doing that. So instead, what I'm going to do is, since we're on 73, I figured, why not do some quests, and try to level up, get some more gear, and do a little bit more stuff. Uh, actually, I think there's an NPC on the ship that we can actually do. Uh, what's your name? But anyway, uh, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just do a little bit of questing for the next two episodes. Well, this episode, 74 and 75. Well, no, 75 where we head out to do the next main stuff. So, alright, well, let us figure out what this quest is. So, this guy has a quest, and I believe it might be too challenging for us, but I think we might be able to do this. We don't need to find any more provision for us for a while, but we need to get back in stock with Stor in Tefra Cave. Made out with my life. Okay, interesting. So we have to go get this trader spare key. And I think I might need to get some uh, earth, uh, whatchamacallit equipped in. So let's see if we can do that. See, strength up three, we can replace that. I think it's earth. Cloak. We only have an Earth, earth Cloak 2. I might have to start crafting some. Oh, we have some fives. Wow. Oh, we can actually end up making an Ether 5 gem. Wow. I'm all I got it. Good job. We get an Ether 5 and a weapon power 5. That's actually really good. But I need to see if we have any Earth. Whatchamacallit. So we now have Earth Cloak at 60%. And this should help us with a lot of things. If there's a collection quest. With high level enemies, we can actually do that. So anyway, if we head over to Tefra Cave now, a lot of areas do change. I think he said Villa Lake has a new area over here that we can go over to. And if we can manage to get it... We can then get this quest done, because there's actually a level 97 enemy, I believe, that's blocking it. So if we can finish as much quests as possible, but which is a lot, I think I have a total of like 20 quests that we can still do. And I don't think I put all of them on here. As, yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of level 90 enemies. And I'm pretty sure once we pass through this, we won't be able like, to avoid them. Because it's like a straight line. Also, there's a quest in there apparently. Rumble Stonefly. So I was kind of, what my original plan was, beat the game, and then there's New Game Plus. I was going to go through New Game Plus, but then good thing I looked it into this, because that means, well, there's, whatchamacallit, so we have to deal with. Uh, we have to get every quest again, which I could have done, but that means I have to put the game on pause for like quite a while, and I don't want to. Anyway, there's a heart to heart with Shulken Ryan. I also have a skill tree, so I'll do that real quick. You are so close to finishing off that, and once that's done, we do not have to do anything. You finished that, so... Yay. So let's do this heart to heart. It has shulking things. The Legend of the Spider.
Look, Ryan. This geological formation is incredible. You sure it is? This breeze ain't bad either. Ryan, are you okay? You don't look no more. Wait, you don't normally want to talk about geology and the weather. Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm a bit on edge. Just tell me your straight. Is it me or is these ton of spiders around here? There are quite a few. Oh yeah, now I remember. Just get a spiders. Alright, are you okay? You don't look too good. Sorry, Shark. Why don't we take a break for a bit? It's not a problem at all. Hmm, I'm just trying to think when your phobia started. If I remember right, it was the time when. Come on, man, don't remind me. Uh, if you want to play a prank on you, she's like, oh, your phobia was hilarious. Oh, yeah, that was gross. How could she have done that? No. Wait a minute, that never happened. It was your fault. <laughs> Don't be forgotten. There's a big deal out of it. I don't remember why I did it. Are you kidding me? You did it because, uh, okay, I guess I don't remember either. If we both forgot, I can't let me want to read. I really don't care if we mess up anything because we already maxed out infinity with these two anyway. Unless get messing another thing up. But yeah, if you had to go through this. These guys would have automatically have fought us if we didn't have. Well, there's still a chance that well, we will get in fights like that. Uh, Vang got into a fight with us, but only he got into a fight with us. And also, I think all the Vings are getting into it because it's sound base. Oh my good musical van flare. Right, so we have to go over here. Oh no, wait. Why are there... Oh, those arachnids are what we need for the uh, friendship quest. That's right. Of course there's uh, gold gold in here. Why wouldn't... The Heavenly window. Oh, there's another, whatchamacallit. And then, there are two unique monsters in there. What? That was something else I was thinking about doing before I head out, was discover all the uh, secret areas. Because it would give us a first load of experience. Like, I'm pretty sure because of that, we've maxed something out. Like, you did that, that's it. So it gives us a burst of experience. There's something down here. What? What? Oh, uh, maybe if I'm right next to them, I would end up getting a. Uh, like, there's just so many things in here. And don't mind me, guys. Oh no, this is a dead end. Again, still don't mind me, guys. Just walk past these guys and just keep going down here. I wonder if this takes me to that one location that I keep seeing a uh, path of absolution. Ooh. If this takes me to that one thing, I keep seeing. I'm like, how do you get to that part? Now this isn't a, uh, I think, monster quest. Let me go down and look at the, uh, whatchamacallit. Yeah, these are just straight of spirit key. Oh, it's back there. So it's back there. Alright, so we're gonna do this, this tactic of jump. Okay, no.
All right, there you go. Uh, he got stuck, and I think if you just sit out of range where he keep he's constantly walking towards you, and pretty much can't move, and you're not in battle with him, I think he just gives up and it's like, okay, I I'm done. So we was able to get that. Collect the emergency rations from this. So we have to go continue going forward. Whoa, what's with the whole, whole like heavenly light? Kind of cool. But yeah, I fit the collection quest with like high level enemies. I might consider doing them because with the uh, earth cloak, you can get past a lot of these enemies. Of course, sound based ones, not so much. So let's keep on running. There's a hole right there. So back to over here. That's where we have to go. That's probably a lower floor, so. So, uh, okay, hold on. Oh, it's back there. I was like, wait, where are we supposed to go? Here we go. Emergency beer house. Let me get some. Not bad. So that's a high level quest done. Yep, exactly over here. And this should finish off this quest line. Which is really good. So pretty much helping these uh Hyantia. Not bad at all. So that's one quest uh, out of our thing. Also, there's a quest back here, I just now realize. Is it Ernest that gives us another quest? Is this Dolan again? Hello. So he has a quest for us called... I believe, A Flower for a Rose. You like flowers? That's... So I have to get one Ancient Lily. So it is another collection quest, sadly. Well, not sadly. I think it's a lot more better for us to do collection-based stuff and not actually full-fledged stuff. So in Tefra Cave, once again, there is a place we can go. I think it's basically where we just was. It should be in here. That should be like a loader cave we can enter. Maybe it's up there. Oh, it's down here. And this, well, that's why there's a quest thing over here. Or take us to Bal Balfologar Tomb. 
Uh, there's a NPC here that we can talk to that's looking for us. This, but I believe what we want to do is go to the back side of it. All right. So once again, I chose to accept a quest that I physically cannot do. Well, at least we got this uh, quick travel point now. Uh, because we can do the first mission, yes, but we won't be able to do the second mission, which it requires us to fight a level 97 mission, uh, unique monster. We are so close to finishing that. Alright, so we are going to Satolo Marsh now to get this one NPC and transfer him over. He is probably going to be one of our strong... Oh, she. Yeah, my bad. It's going to be one of our best... Uh, NPCs to bring over. I don't know where they are though. Uh, he's at 1800, and I think it's this one. Yep. So if we talk to this person, we will invite her to Colony 6. Her traits will be changed uh, if you want to. I think in, while she's in Satoru Marsh. She has, I think, some good items, not really, not much. So let's go back to here. And we can do a quest. Uh, where would this be? Oh, it's uh, the day NPC that will give us this. That's probably what's his face. Yep. There's a quest down here. And that's who we need to talk to. We talk to her. We will get a quest called Smoke. Oh, uh, Ox Smoke. Speak to the owner of the house that Smoke is coming from. Will that actually show me which house that is? Has to be night for this quest to be accepted, and it's right here. There's actually smoke coming out of it. No. Hello. What's with the face? Something goofy in the air? Of course you're here because of the smoke. Everything's fine. Nothing to worry about it. You can move on. So you just worry. I say here at the house, I can assure that the smoke itself is nothing to worry about. Everything is under control. Hello. But if we trade with her real quick. Uh, she has filled shoes. Is that not that like, great? Rumble coal. She does have anything useful right now. But if we can get it to five, four star, she will she have good footing three and not two. But that's not even the best part of it. If you can get her to oh this to five stars. She sells or trades the love source, but of course you need to be super bosses to get that. But something else that I want to do, what is your most cheapest thing? We want to over trade with 7,000 or more. So let's just do this. If you over trade, <laughs> she will give us the Hawks Daylight uh, Spore, which I don't know how much we need for that. Uh, we need two more, and then we can level up this, and that'll be great. Hello. Back today, we can now turn this quest in. We are good. Really simple quest to do: get some experience, some money, and level up with Shulk. But if we actually change it to night now, please don't tell me I actually have like four stars affinity. She will have a quest for us. So 
you wish to him you may me. Yes, exactly. My entire goal. So we have to get dated plugs and dated crank from a... Uh, whatchamacallit, uh, falling on. And what I can do is... Put that in there so we can go do that. But before we do that, let's level up our thing one last time. Well, not one last time. We still have a lot more we can do, but for now, once we get everything to level four, so that's why once we finish off the second part, and before we head into Prison Island, I want to actually complete, whatchamacallit, uh, try to get everything at least, not maxed out, but at least to level four. Or maybe some of them level five, but some of them level one. That is a big tree. Look at all that. We got all these trees now. It's gonna make a uh, colony six just look beautiful. It's like I thought it just randomly disappeared. Right. What do we need for level four now? For this one, I know what we need. We can get the flexible ones, but the still ones we have to actually go inside. So we have to do that stuff later. Uh, for this one, mm, I feel like we can do that one. Actually, not that bad. Red Frontier, I actually remember seeing that someone trades that. So a lot of stuff we can grab. Uh, is it nature? No, it's special. We need to get special level for it so we can get the Collectopedia stuff for the places that we don't have done. So let's head to... To the Fallen Arm we go. I don't know. Oh, the items drop from Mech on. I thought they were collection stuff, but nope, they are Mech on stuff that we have to fight. New, 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 new. Don't like that. Oh, all three of the data plugs are done, so... Now what we need to get from these mech on right here... No, uh, these... Things off the thing that we need. I also got Burst and, uh... Art man rolled as well. From that, and I got the second crane. The best way to get to those be by doing that, but I'm just gonna travel back to this and just keep rinse and repeat that. Those two enemies. And another dated crane. And that will finish off what we need. Going back to colony six to turn in our quest. At last, now I can fix my device. I believe some things are in order. Glad everything worked out. We did a good job. Quest complete. And that changed the affinity. I don't think there's any more quests. There's a quest up here, though. Uh, I think this is uh, a quest called... Something determination. Thank you, that was good. But Melfi did not want Armors to laze around in the colony farm. Uh, so we need. Just two broom icicles. I want to change up our party again. Uh, bring out these three just so we can get more affinity. Alright, heading over to Valak Mountain to get our two rewards that we need. And they are in here. 
They must be collectible stuff. And one is over here. And the other one I believe is up there. So we have to go here and then walk away down. Not bad. I do think I used up a lot of my uh energy uh, today with the recording. And uh I don't think I want to try to beat this team while still being in this uh house anymore because it just takes way too much. Is this a unique monster? Oh it is. There's still I, I hear all of us. And here's the reward. The two things we needed. Back to Colony 6 we go. So I think this is going to be what well, I'm going to call it quits for that night once I get done with this episode, which is going to be relatively soon. We didn't really do that much questing. I think we completed I told like four quests out of like the 20 we have, but that's fine. At least in the next episode, I can plan out like which ones I want to do and stuff like that. And then grab all the items I need because I can also do some small grinding because if I have to fight certain enemies to get like certain things, I will do all that stuff. Get some affi items so we can uh, grow our affinity with our NPCs and do some heart to hearts. Oh, ha, ha. Voice complete. So that quest is done. I don't know what our. It's still four, uh, three stars. Scientist pals. Let's go get some stuff done, which is anyway, good. Uh, but I think that's what we're going to end it off here. So next time on our Xenoblade playthrough, we will finish off a little bit more questing before heading off. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.